Morning, Jono. Morning, Stefan. How's it? Morning, yourself. Nice man. to see you again, my friend. The day has finally arrived. The day is here, eh? Yeah. So, you ready, Stefan? Yeah, ready. Um, you told me it's not going to be easy. No, uh, that's for sure. Yeah, some climbing and stuff. And yes, yes. Just, uh, me and my, my, uh, my, my friend and cameraman, Andrew, uh, we tried for some Eland earlier in the year and, and uh, you know, getting, getting into within a hundred of those scallum creatures are not that easy. That's, so that, we're that, gonna that's the truth. Eh? Not, they are quite wise. Eh? Yeah. They pick up your tricks quite easy. No, yeah, no, for sure. So the wind is picking up a little bit. That's that's yeah. normally good for hunting is, something yes. something as sly as an Eland. Yes. So the wind with a, with a nice strong wind in your favor and the wind blowing in the ears and what might have half a chance. So. No, definitely. Well, I see you already loaded up, so... Um, Should we get uh, going? Yeah, it's, 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 it's uh, I don't know, what do you say, 20, 20, 30, 30 20 minute, minute drive. drive, yeah, to the mountains there. Okay. Let's right. have a look. Good luck. Good Hopefully you'll come around. <laughs> <laughs> nice stuff. Nice one, this one. Stefan, <clears throat> well, we are in the mountains, as I said. And there's a gully that, that runs between these two mountains. He has one big copy, and then there's another big copy there, and then it keeps on going. There's about three or four of them like this. Okay. But um, we're going to go over to the top of this and then glass into so the... So we stop the vehicles here, we're going to walk yeah, from here. Yeah, we're going to walk in from here. We're going to get onto the top of this mountain. It's pretty high. It's going to take us a while to get up there. And then from the top there, we can see into the center, and then hopefully if we... If we, if we if we can see them, then we'll, we'll be able to plan in our stalk with the wind in our yeah. favor and get close. And if we don't see them, we keep continuing. We keep, we keep on going until we find them. Yeah. A lot of earland here, lots of big bulls, okay. old bulls. And I think that's what we're after. That's exactly what we're after. I mean, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, this, uh, the sun's been coming on for a, you know, for a while now, and, uh, and, and, and we're looking for a nice, old, mature earland bull to, to round off this, this spiral on slam we have to offer in South Africa. So, um, yeah. Nice. Looking forward to the week. You you joined me on my on my Nyala hunt a yes, couple yes, of yes, couple yes. of weeks ago, and yeah, this is it. This is number four, and Yaland is always a special hunt. Always doesn't Definitely. matter who you are, with what you're shooting, where you are in the country or in the world. It's 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 always a nice hunt. Yes. But I think to to do it with a double and trying getting under 100 meters, I know it's oh, yes. challenging. Definitely, I've, yeah. I failed many times, <laughs> so hopefully this week we can. Let's uh, see if we can get it right. We can get yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> we see some Yeland on the on the opposite mountain over there, but Jono, we we arranged it. It's over 800 meters to there, and I believe it's very steep down. Yeah. Yes, it is. Yeah. Anyway, so what's the plan? We're we gonna go for those, or that's a looks like about a three-hour little gander. That so yeah. what we're gonna try and do first of all is try and move along the side of this mountain and keep looking down. There's okay. a lot of Yeland here, so. No, we've only spotted like five there's or six, only, yes, yeah, so yeah. it's not a hole. It's not nothing. It's and there's far. obviously, I mean, it's too far to have a real good look, but yes. there's nothing that yeah. stands out and say nothing, nothing right now. We no. keep so looking. Let's, let's keep on going along the edge, yeah, okay. and uh, see how that works out. All right, hundreds. The bush was thick and the climb as steep as hell. With burning calves within an hour, I knew this was going to be a tough hunt.
Stefan, as you know, the eland put their horns up into the tree and they have a really strong neck. They break off the, the branches to get to the, the sweeter or greener leaves, if you want to call it, at the top. So the reason is for, 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 for the leaves growing up high, breaking yeah. the tree down so they, so can, they can get to it. You can see there's a lot, yeah. a lot in this area. And yeah. is it only the bulls that does it or is it the cows? I think, I think, I think it's all of them, right, to be dead honest. Okay, so yeah. it's all about feeding. Yeah, it's all about it's feeding, yeah. Okay. Get, getting right up to the top, to the yeah, to There's the a lot of leaves. broken trees up here. Yeah. It's a lot. We're quite high up as well. <laughs> 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 serious stuff. Yeah, serious climb ups here. Fantastic. In the only single road on the property, I saw one of the biggest Impala rams ever, with massive horns. The temptation was definitely there, but we stuck to the plan. I had to get an Elan to complete my slam. After a tough morning session of climbing and glassing, we reached our fly camp again for some welcome snacks and cold drinks. Hello, Julie. That was a grab and stab. <laughs> <laughs> The afternoon session started the same way, climbing, climbing, climbing. Stefan, we're going to take this ridge line down to the bottom again. It's going to take us some time to get down. As you can see, it's quite steep. I mean, you just saw on the way up. So let's, uh, we're going to make our way back and on we go. Keep, uh, keep your feet under your body. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So this bush here is what they call in Afrikaans a haken steek. Or, as Mr. Joseph translates it directly, a grab and stab. <laughs> so the one horn is like this, it grabs you, and the other one stabs you. So yeah, that's the end of day one. We're back where we started this yeah. morning, Jono. That's it. Uh, about, what, 10? 10 k's? Yes, I'm climbing these. <laughs> six, six, five, six hundred meters up and down. But let me tell you, it's a different story with these double rifles. Eh? Yeah. Carrying them in these mountains it's, without yeah. this thing. It's, <laughs> it's heavier. It's something else. But it was nice. I mean, it's, it was Sometimes. still a nice day's hunt. Yeah. We're going to head back to camp now. I mean, there's still a good hour, maybe more left. On but, you know, there. killing an animal five, six hundred meters just from here up in the mountain. Yeah, the recovery is going to take six, seven hours to take it yeah. out. You know, you so know the story about an uh, Elan. Where do you hunt the Elan? Yeah, close to the road. There's <laughs> only one road here. Uh, so, yeah, no, but we'll uh, we'll head back to camp and we'll yes. be out tomorrow morning early again. Thanks, yes. it was a great day, Zanti. Fantastic, hunting. fantastic. Thanks so much. All right. Lekker.
Uh, Jolo, uh, after a, a good night's nice rest, yeah. we're, we're back in the field this morning. Tender legs, like you say. Huh? Yes, yeah. Very, uh, <laughs> very tender legs. But yeah, we, and shoulders. Yes, yeah. It gets heavy in the mountains. Yeah. So. Anyway, so plan is we're gonna move on through and take another. The wind. Walk. The wind was yesterday. It caught us a, few, uh, a couple of times. Right? Yeah. Uh, we 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 shifted this Swirling whole morning. The whole day. This whole morning, it's been blowing a little bit stronger from one side. So um, we came around this whole property. And we're starting it from a totally different corner than yesterday. Yes. Working into the wind, trying to get the noise, the noise levels favor, that, yeah. in our favor, and obviously the wind in our favor, so the animals don't smell us. Because surprise, you're gonna have to surprise Eland. I mean, we've seen Eland here at three, four hundred meters all the time, but to get it within hundred meters, you're gonna the element of surprise will have to be with you. That's yeah. No, that's that's the that's the the trick here. Yeah. yeah. So let's give it a go. Huh? Let's give it a go. Let's Perfect. load up and uh, make ready. That's it. So Jono, we we've been we've been walking this whole morning, and um, again only saw some some feeb, some cows. Um, we decided to get head back to the vehicle and move to a different hunting area. And as we crossed this ridge over here, we spotted these eland at about eight nine hundred meters away. Yes. So we came closer, and then uh, this is the we we decided to stop. I mean they about they just at the end of this of this little hill here. Yeah. That's another what five six hundred meters from here. So what's the, that, uh, what, what's the plan? Well, the wind's pretty strong. Today. Like we said, it's been blowing pretty hard the whole day. So we're going to move up, and then hopefully, if we can get uh, the, that's a herd, we do know there's a bull there. We had to come around because yeah. of the wind. Yes, that was the first. The wind is flipping, that's, whirling again. This whole the, the mountains make it difficult. Yeah. It blows one way and the other. So we're going to have a let's take a walk up there. It's getting close to midday. Yeah, this will be our last one for now. And then, and then, then we stop because we're yeah. already 35 degrees. Yeah, it's cooking. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but let's go. Let's, let's are we going to just stick to this tree line yeah? We're going to stick to this tree line, move into that set of bush and then go up. Alright. 100. One of the very few sand areas <laughs> across this road where you can actually see a kill on tracks. Very difficult to see the tracks in these rocks. <laughs> eh? <laughs> between a 3 inch um, 500 nitro cartridge and the track of a big yellow bull so uh, hopefully this is the bull we saw from up up the hill the opposite ridge line. Yeah.
With the Elan stopping in an open piece of felt, we headed straight for them, but we couldn't get closer than 140 meters. With the felt fire moving through our hunting area, we lost the Elan and only found them an hour and a half later. Firefighters are on their way. Not too far out. There should be a couple of minutes or so. Interesting Yelland hunt, though. Another one? You did? That first shot looks on the shoulder. Well done. Come on, he's, he's standing there still. Let's go up there. Reload it on safe. You see him? This one looks like in the middle of the shore. Fantastic. Well done, Stefan. Fantastic stuff, my brother. Wow. Well done, my friend. That's a boss, sir. It's a massive, massive, massive yellow. Congrats. Well, the second one definitely clipped the neck. Yeah. That's what put him down so quickly. Yes. Old bull, eh? Old bull. Old, old, old bull. Look Man. at the size of those tracks, eh? Shit, he's got some hoops. Check there. there. Yeah. Yes, once again, Stephen, that's some good shooting, eh? Johnny. Well, well done. Thank you so much, my friend. Fantastic work. <laughs> it was a, it was a tough two days, eh? It yes, has been. Uh, my legs are done, eh? Um, Tender uh, legs. And we our were shorts lucky. are done. <laughs> yeah, your shorts are done. I screwed up another pair yesterday, but um, I mean, luck, luckily, luckily they they made a mistake. They I mean, they turned mistake. around and they were on the way to the other side, yes. which is about 200 meters or what away, and we were yes. sitting in the middle of nowhere. And all of a sudden they turned and uh, a couple of those spring back ran past the front of them might have confused them yeah man oh man and the, the moment they saw us they turned around and they came in what, what was the distance 88 89 89, 89 meters yeah. yeah man what a shot i mean flip him over now but jeez but the size of this thing in the group eh? i mean it, it was just it's a good foot taller than everything else yes, you see him immediately yeah, yeah you start cross. looking you see the bulls and you just see this guy uh, this yeah. is the same one we saw this morning eh? it's the same one yeah yeah you can see he's got those wide horns sir. yeah and he's got a how, how we how we saw him again was was the white of his head yes it's quite yeah you know behind the ears and it, it's uh yeah it's, pretty, it's yeah. prominent so you, he stood out amongst everyone yeah but the and and, and wide, the broom on his forehead as well yes. you know it's a yeah. man oh man no you're perfect the knee in this corner yeah mm. Well, Stefan, congratulations. It's been a tough two days, but we ended up getting it. Yes. Fantastic bull. Great shooting, great hunting. It was really exciting. It was an exciting two days, John. I must say, it was, it was, it was really hard work. 
Um, it was. Uh, we were lucky in the end, we but were. that's how it works. Eh? It's part of it. Yeah. But, but we we worked really hard. I mean, this bull didn't come. come it didn't come, come easy. Eh? Didn't Not come at all. Easy. And and what a special way to end it. I mean, with a special buddy and uh, yeah. you guys run an excellent outfit. You you and you and your staff is. I mean, it's been an absolutely amazing two days. It's fantastic. It's, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, we, and I mean to to hunt a big thing and a and a, and a you know it's not easy to hunt it. Yeah. No, not at all. With any gun, but to try and keep it under 100 meters, we could have had one this morning at 140. Um, but that wasn't part of the plan since no. the beginning. And uh, and it's a special it's a special evening for me, you know, with the, with the sun setting. Yeah, and it's. Yes. It's it's the fourth it's the fourth animal of, of, of the spiral slam you are able to hunt in South Africa and and we decided to do it uh, in, a, in in an even more special way with the doubles and open sighted and under hundred so thank you so much for the opportunity and and, and thank you for the way you conducted on you're a special friend and, and it was it was really a privilege hunting with well, you well listen congratulations once again it's a pleasure thanks Jonah there we go definitely not the last time definitely not.